Hey folks, and thanks for joining me. Let's look at another Q multiplier circuit that I built, and uh, we'll hook it up here to the transistor radio. Then I had one of my viewers ask if I could use it with a uh, All American Five radio with a built-in loop antenna, and we'll try that as well. Let's power this up and give it a test. You can hear as I bring it closer to the uh, receiver that uh, we start hearing some improvement. Now let's power up the unit. So you can hear the significant difference. This is a station, uh, what, 40, 50 miles away, low power, AM transmitter. Let's hook it up now on the uh, All-American 5 radio and listen to the results. So if you listen real close here on the All-American 5, again, the uh, loop antenna is on the back here. And let me place the uh, ferrite antenna here. We'll plug in the Q multiplier. So you can hear the difference it makes. Let me adjust the feedback. Unplug the Q multiplier. Power back up the Q multiplier. And let's just remove the uh, Q multiplier. So you can hear it will work with even an All-American 5. That answers a uh, question I had from one of my viewers of the channel. Again, the uh, loop antenna here on the back itself and the station itself is in this direction back west from my uh, home. And you can see the big improvement that it does make. I'll share the uh, schematic with you guys. Just check out the uh, show more video description for a link if you want to build uh, this simple Q multiplier. I think it's easier to build than the uh, recent posting that I uh, did as well. I appreciate you guys uh, watching. Everyone out there, uh, take care. Stay well.